So I'm doing a few little jobs on my balcony today. One of them is harvesting a few things to make a first smudge stick of the year. Obviously I'm cutting really badly because I'm trying to film here, but I harvest a bit of lavender, but I make sure that I leave lots for the bees as well, because I've actually seen two really big ones this year, which is fantastic. And I'm hoping to encourage more of them. So I like to leave them plenty of bits as well also taking some sage I'll come back to that in a bit now the other thing I wanted to do was I have this plant here which I'm just not that keen on I'm sort of over it so I decided to repot it and put my potatoes that are growing in a sh more shallow container into here along with a few other veggies as you can see it's very compacted in here now I'm not going to waste it, obviously I'm going to put it in some pots and I'm going to either give them away or put them in different places on my balcony or give them to my family and just reuse the pot because space is very very tight on my balcony and I have to be careful how I use every little bit of it so if I want to start growing some vegetables this summer I can't really have plants taking up space that I'm not that keen on so yeah I'm just putting some soil uh, compost and a bit of some old soil that I've got here that has some perlite into this big container Lilith of course sat here keeping guard for me If I'm honest with you, I don't even really eat potatoes, but I just stuck a couple that I got from the organic shop into this window box and they grew so well, really quickly, that I just thought I'm going to have to give these guys a chance. So I've got two of them and I've also got some radishes and some garlic that I'm going to put in here because I love garlic leaves in the summer and I don't really even know anything about radishes but I got a few growing. I love to do that, I love to get food from the organic shop and regrow it because radishes you can just regrow from the top and also carrots you can cut the top off and put them in water and the same with lettuce so I'm going to build this collection as I keep getting food from the organic shop and I'm just going to take the bases off and I'm going to start growing it on my balcony. My chard now has a bit more space, now it doesn't have potatoes taking over. And now I'm just gonna divide this up and put it into a few big pots so that it's not gonna go to waste because I just couldn't bear to kill a plant. So I'm sure I'll find something to do with it. It's actually one of those big white lily. I can't remember the name of it, but it has big white lilies. back to the sage sticks but I basically like to leave them to dry out overnight so when I come to make one I'll show you the process. 